I, I changed my title uh, yesterday. My topic is uh, my, ma my, my magic words. Yeah. And uh, yes. good evening, I'm Lindu, and I'm from the Department of Political Science. I'm the sophomore. And today I'm going to tell you my magic sentence and uh, why I was wanting to join the NTU Toastmasters. When I was in junior high school, my math teacher told us, chance is always waiting for those who fly for their goals to the last minute. And even though I hate math the most, and <laughs> I almost forget all the math things he told me, but his words follow me and he, uh, follow me and makes me to conquer the difficulties in my life. So now let me show you some experience that I had. Uh, in the high school entrance exam, I uh, unlike my class, most of my classmates, they got a good grades and they can enter the the bad high school in my hometown. I did a bad job, and it was a strike to me, and I was really desperate. I didn't know how to do next, and I just planned to give all the chances to take the second exam. Yeah, but however this time, those words came to me and forced me to look back on my study in junior high. Then I found that I missed a lot of details in my textbooks, and I thought they are not important at all, but not really. Yeah, so I decided to reread all the textbook in detail again, not only for the entrance exam, but also for me to accomplish my own responsibility. In the end, like uh, uh, like movies have empty endings, I got mine. But more important for me is not going to the high school I want, is not being stopped by, stopped by the failure. Okay. It, it's not that this is the end of my story. I went to a good high school and now I'm into you. Sounds boring, right? <laughs> no, not yet. Yes, not yet. I'm going to show you more uh, how these magic words help me in my following life. In high school, I was in the humanity humanity gifted class, and we were asked to finish a formal report by ourselves. And I chose a topic about the law and politics, which illustrated in civil education. And it was really hard for a high school student. And I had to read a lot of papers every day. And my teacher was actually, she was really strict to me. She asked me to rewrite my report over and over again. It did frustrate me. And that moment, the concept of giving up can occur. But hopefully, my magic words help me again and it makes me to be strong. And I told myself I have to try my best, even though, and no matter what the consequences. And yeah, again, I finish it and I give a presentation to my class. And after the presentation, my teacher told me, Lin, maybe you are not my best student, but you are a student who make the biggest pro progress I have ever took. Yeah, it really, it really taught, I was really touched. And that time I said my goal, I want to be the professor in the future. Yeah, mm, I believe that the true meaning of education is not to create the best students who can get good grades on tests, is to make all the students find their own interest and then they will try their best to achieve their goals. So I found my own because of my high school experience, because I always keep that important sentence in my mind. And this summer vacation, I went to Thailand and Burma to visit the local schools. I was really impressed by the students there, there who are so eager to learn everything. And it made me curious about the education systems in different countries. And I know if I want to visit the other countries, uh, the first step I have to do is improving my poor English. So I was really appreciate Richard 
introduced huh. and your toes nature to me. Yeah, and I like I love it in only several weeks. And yeah, in several weeks. Don't cry. <laughs> I'm so touched. Yes, yeah, I believe. Uh, even though I'm re I even though I'm really nervous now, but my lecture sentence chance is always for those who fight for their girls to the last minute makes me brave and strong to stand here to give you a speech. Yeah, I believe with those words, I can be a good speaker someday, and I will keep going in until Toastmasters. Yeah, Toastmaster of the event. <laughs>